All right, here we go. Question number nine from our 1316 homework number four in my lab math. And here they want us to establish the identity. Okay, if you took trig previously in high school, maybe this is also called a trig proof. We're going to prove that the left hand side equals the right hand side by doing uh, trigonometric substitutions. So if we look at the problem, it says the first thing they want me to do is write the left side in terms of sine and cosine. So I notice the sine they brought down. What they want me to do is convert secant theta into terms of sine or cosine. So what we happen to know is that secant is the reciprocal of cosine. So doing a trig substitution, we can replace secant theta with 1 over cosine theta because they are reciprocal identities. Okay, so that's going to be 1 over cosine theta. And they do have a theta to choose from. Now, write the result from the previous step as a single fraction. All right, so what does that mean as a single fraction? It means they want me to go ahead and do the multiplication. So if I convert sine theta into a fraction, I do that by putting it over 1. And then to multiply fractions, I multiply straight across. And so that'll give me sine theta over cosine theta as a single fraction. All right, so that'll be sine theta over cosine theta. So far, so good. The fraction from the previous step then simplifies to tangent theta using what? Now you're going to have to know what that identity is called. Well, it's definitely not the cancellation property. Uh, sine over cosine is tangent. That's not an even odd property. It's not a Pythagorean identity. Do you see what I'm doing? I'm doing the process of elimination. If I know what it can't be, then I'll know what it has to be. Cancellation, even odd, Pythagorean, none of those fit. It's either a reciprocal or a, okay, it's not a reciprocal identity because that would mean flipping something over. No, this is the quotient identity. Quotient. Quotient in math means a fraction. So that means that tangent theta as a fraction is sine over cosine. That is a quotient identity. And that is done. Man, I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put those in the comment section below, or you can text me. And thanks for watching.